was supposed to start my tour yesterday or today from Vintuk, a 10-day tour around Namibia with my guest from Russia. I was supposed to pick them up yesterday at Osia Kutako Airport at 1 o'clock. Just to be told by my agent on Saturday that they had to cancel the tour because uh, of flights that could not fly through to Sadek. We started getting cancellation left, right and center. So far, I got, since Saturday, I got already four cancellations. And we're talking about over nearly half a million dollars that we are losing as a business. And, and, and this is just a big blow for us. We feel that uh, it is so unfair that Namibia is being punished with the rest of SADC. I mean, if you look at our numbers of cases that have been dropping rapidly per day and the numbers of over, I mean, positive cases that, that, that are not escalating, we are one of the least affected countries when it comes to COVID lately because of the numbers that have been dropping. So I don't know why we are getting swept with the same whip to the rest of other countries. And what is our government doing about this? You know, we haven't heard anything from, from the Namibian government as to what they think about this, what's their take on this, what are they doing about this, how are they going to help um, Namibia, you know, being taken away from the rest of Sadek or, you know, just doing something regarding, regarding, regarding to this matter. I've read today about South Africa's government really fighting tooth and nail uh, regarding this issue. So what is our government doing? Where are we? There's nothing happening, you know. So it's about time that we really stood up, or our government stood up and take this matter very seriously and not wait for South Africa first to make the first move, then only we make our move. It's about time that our government stood up and start taking matters into our own hands and take this thing seriously because this is affecting the tourism sector as a whole in Sadek and mostly in Namibia.